Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by my channel. Certainly appreciate y'all taking time out of your day to pay me a visit. Uh, it is Saturday, October 9th. Uh, just a little bit before 11.30 and uh, launched out of Fox River Shores on the Fox River. Uh, just uh, a little bit uh, north of Carpentersville. Um, we're gonna be looking for some smallmouth. Uh, this is the second time I've had my boat out since it sank in my last video. Um, still looking to find a few gremlins uh, that might exist. Um, I do have some electrical work that I, I still need to do, and I'm just putting it off till winter. Only got maybe about another month of uh, fishing left. Um, but anyway, let's go see what we can find. Uh, I'm going to really just be motoring around looking for schools of uh, bait fish uh, there's three other boats out here it's not a very large pool so i'm gonna go to uh, a spot that i don't think a lot of people go to first and see what we can find First fish of the day on my second cast. Better than the first cast. Not a monster, but oh man. Looks like a turtle tried to take a chunk out of him. Feels a little bit better. Yeah, it's got some nice colors. Okay. This guy is hooked directly where I want to hold him. There we go. Thank you. Wow, that has some gorgeous colors on that fish. Come on, buddy. You can do it. <laughs> well, small guys are certainly aggressive. Well, not as good as I was expecting, but that's what happens when you've been catching nothing but dinks. I 
All right, feisty fellow, probably 13 inch. That was on a uh, bone colored Super Spook Junior. Actually bent out one of my hooks. There's a good one. Oh. <laughs> Alright, not that good a one. He's just foul hooked. <laughs> Alright, sorry buddy. Feisty fellow. Doesn't feel like a very big one, but it's a fish. Came on a little bitsy bug jig with a TRD craw trailer. Fish. Fish. Of course, that. man, this guy is really bug eyed. That's a solid fish.
don't think my scale works, but we'll give it a try. Nope. Scale is dead from the boat sinking, so let's just get a measurement on this real quick. Guess this is a 18 inch fish. Uh, 17 and a half. It's pretty good. It's a nice fish. Let's get a photo of this girl. All right, see you later. That's a good fish. Um, maybe not. Doesn't feel all that big. No, it's decent. as nice as the last one but decent fish get you hooked in the head that was a fat fish Yeah, it's the first time I've ever seen that happen. The guy uh, bent out the rear uh, split ring. I saw it fail before it fell off. I'm gonna do some surgery on this guy. Well, I definitely found a little school of them. We got some bait fish corralled up on that gravel point. These guys are certainly being aggressive about it, but man, they are missing it. Getting themselves hooked in the heads and all sorts of weird places.
Oh. <laughs> Well, even if they are small, they're still fun to catch. You literally could not have hooked yourself in a worse spot, buddy. smallest one yet Oop. okay all right going the wrong way there you go All right, everyone, that's going to do it for us. I uh, didn't record an outro the day that I shot this footage. Uh, I wasn't quite sure whether I was going to share this all or not. Uh, it was a decent day of fishing, don't get me wrong. Um, anytime you find those kind of numbers, it's fun. Uh, I was just hoping to find a little bit more size that day. Um, but either way, um, we got a few more weeks of fishing. Um, you know, this year went by really quick. Um, I'm not going to ramble too much, though, uh, but I did want to thank everyone for sticking with me this entire uh, time. Gearing up for winter, um, I am going to do something that uh, I wasn't planning on doing, but uh, as some of you may know, I paint lures over the winter. That's kind of my hobby. Uh, it keeps, my, keeps me sane while I can't go fishing. Um, Unfortunately for me, I've already painted pretty much everything that I could possibly use uh, in the the future. <laughs> uh, the good news for uh, some of you may be that I am going to start selling uh, some of these levers that I paint every now and again. Um, we're just going to kind of dabble into this. I, I definitely don't want it to be... Uh, you know, my main job or even a side hustle. This is just something, again, to kind of keep me busy during the week, uh, the winter. Um, I do have a stockpile of uh, square bills that I am uh, ready to, to kind of start um, sharing with you all. Um, I'm going to post a link up here uh, for you on the screen. I don't want to over-advertise these too much. Um, I'm going to share it with you fine folks that have... Uh, stuck this long in the video and uh it's just a tiny url just pop that into um any of your web browsers and i'll pull up my ebay um posting for that uh if you don't like ebay or you rather stick local um again i'm based out of uh the northwest chicago area 
uh, Cary, Crystal Lake, Fox River Road, Algonquin, that kind of area. Uh, you can shoot me an email. Uh, my email is in my um, about me over here on uh, YouTube, and uh, shoot me an email. We can we can work something out possibly uh, that way to avoid the eBay fees if you guys would rather do that. But um, eBay is going to be my preferred method at this point in time. So uh, thanks again, everyone, and uh, we will catch you all next time.